Hey, I'd like to welcome you to another episode of the Mission Matters Money Podcast, your source for all things money. My name is Adam Torres. You can follow me on Instagram at Ask Adam Torres. Keep up with my book releases, book tour schedule, signings, all that other good stuff. Always love to connect with you there. And as always, if you'd like to apply to become a co-author of one of my upcoming books, just head on over to the website, missionmatters.com, and click on Become an Author to Apply. All right, so today I have Amy Majori on the line, and she's a real estate investor, educator, and HGTV personality. Um, Amy, welcome to the show. Thank you. Excited to be here. Oh, man, it's so great to have you back on the show. I know you've been on uh, multiple other times, and uh, when I heard you were launching a new course, I'm like, oh, Amy, you got to bring that course to my to my <laughs> listeners. So I'm excited to get into it. So the course's name is Raising Private Money for Real Estate Investors and Entrepreneurs, uh, and you're definitely the woman to be speaking on that. But And I want to get into the course. But before we do, um, for the listeners maybe that have, didn't catch your previous episodes with me, um, let's go a little bit further into your background. So tell us a little bit more about how you got started sure absolutely it's funny because my background is very traditional you know just like most people out there I went to school I got the grades got a job in corporate America and worked and worked and worked for 14 years at Dell computers and then back in 2012 I decided finally I figured out what I wanted to do with my life and it was not computers so I actually uh, was on a quest for knowledge and started to pursue my passion and entrepreneurship um, in the real estate industry. And so in 2012 in downtown Chicago, I started flipping houses. And, um, you know, sure, you can say I was lucky, blessed, fortunate, whatever. I also put in a, a lot of time, hard work, and energy. And as a result, you know, I did have a lot of immediate success, which was pretty cool. I've had plenty, plenty, plenty of failures as well. So what happened was in 2014, as a result of, you know, the success, I actually started coaching other real estate investors all over the country on how they too can set up their real estate business business the right way with ethics, everything from A to Z, from hiring contractors, raising private money, knowing how to analyze a property, anything you need in order to set up your real estate business the right way. And um, that's been a lot of fun, and I did that for five years, and that led to public speaking. I started keynote speaking all over the country, which was cool. I did a four-part series with HTTV, ended up writing a best-selling book, and it's funny because even as I hear myself say that stuff, it's nothing I'd ever planned on doing. And um, so it's definitely been a wild ride, but I love it. And, you know, my husband, I actually met through real estate. So it's funny because he's kind of the commercial guru in our relationship. I'm the residential guru. And so we do a little bit of everything. We flip, we wholesale, we lend, we invest in commercial syndication. So it's definitely been, it's a good match. It's been a lot of fun. Man, that's amazing. And uh, and I'm, I'm glad you kind of have that. Um, first off, thank you for sharing all that, but I, I like your well-rounded background that you have so many different angles to really um, to really come at this from in terms of creating your course because many people, and not, not down in anybody's course, by the way, but I mean, you want to learn from somebody that's been through, you know, different markets, different market cycles, and has different experiences within the industry. So um, that brings me to today's topic. So your new course, uh, Raising Private Money for Real Estate Investors and Entrepreneurs. Um, tell us about this course. This is exciting. Thanks. I'm super excited about it. Even you just saying that gave me goosebumps. I know that sounds cheesy, but I really have not been this excited and passionate about, you know, one of my recent or new projects in a while. Um, and I just love it so much because for me, my daughter, as you know, is almost 10 months old. And wow. uh, once I... <laughs> She's know, like just right? the other day you were being in, you were being interviewed <laughs> and she was still um, with you. <laughs> I know. So what happened was when I found out I was pregnant. This was in January 2019. You know, I I love coaching. It's sure you can say it's my way of getting back, whatever. But for me, it's more than that. I love it. I love watching the success of my students unfold. And so what I wanted to do once I found out I was pregnant with Emma was. I no longer wanted to travel the country, whether it was speaking or coaching, as much as that was a lot of fun to me as well, I really wanted to be a soccer mom. So I decided in January 2019 that 
I'm going to just focus on one aspect of real estate when it came to teaching others. And instead of teaching other real estate investors everything from A to Z, I'm just going to teach them how to raise private money. And it was an easy decision for me to make because I've got plenty, plenty of weaknesses, but raising private money happens to be a towering strength of mine. And the course that um, the next wave actually will go live July 10th, and it's a six-week live coaching program with me, and it's pretty cool because I provide my students with every single script, system, tool, you know, credibility piece, everything I use in my own business in order to raise over $16 million in private money, and my students get access to all of that. So all they have to do is take what I teach them and just start applying it into their own business in order to see results. Man, that's awesome. And I love what I love about that is that you you actually use these tools. You didn't you were sitting at home thinking, Oh, how how can I create a course and how can I sell it? You're like, No, I've already done this. I've been doing this. It works and now you're doing the service of helping your students by sharing that with them so that they can take those proven systems that took you years to develop. You didn't just or well, let me let me ask you, you didn't just like wake up one day, create it and then oh you just raised <laughs> all this money, right? Like did this take some time for you to put this together? <laughs> It did. It actually took me 18 months of consistently fine-tuning and testing every single strategy that I still implement in my business today and that I share with others. So it's it really works. You know, it's not one of these, like, scams. <laughs> I know you and I have talked about in the past. I'm very direct. It's not a scam. I'm a real person. My course really works. No, it's not expensive. Yes, I'm going to tell you it's $997. No, there's no upsell. It's none of that stuff. It's one course. It's all I have. Um, that's all I plan on having. And yes, it works. And I still have availability for my July 10th course. If anyone is interested in learning more, I would be more than happy to talk with you. But it's pretty cool because so many people have fears of, well, I'm a new investor. You know, no one's going to lend me money because I don't have experience. Or I'm not a new investor, but I have poor credit. Or I have low liquidity. Or, you know, I don't have rich friends and family member. How, how am I supposed to go raise money? None of that stuff even matters. And those are consistently common fears and concerns that I have been hearing since 2012. And so that's why I have this course. Like for me, you know, it's it's being able to help someone make that mindset shift and help them realize that they too can achieve similar results if they just understand how to strategically talk to people. That's all it is. That's awesome. So, Amy, if somebody's listening to this and they do want to learn more and they do want to connect, I mean, what's the best way for them to to follow up and and learn more about the about the launch? Sure. Yeah. Thanks for asking. So, definitely connect with me on LinkedIn and Instagram. It, everything on social media is going to be under my first and last name, Amy Majori. You can also check out my um, website, which is raisingcapitalforyourbusiness.com. Or you can go to my main homepage, which is AmyMajori.com. But um, either one of those four, get a hold of me on LinkedIn, Instagram, RaisingCapitalForYourBusiness.com, or AmyMajori.com, and I would love to chat with you. Fantastic. Well, Amy, um, thank you for coming back on the show today, and I'm really happy to bring your course to my audience. Always great reconnecting, and I'm really excited to hear the results and and, and, and the the stories of your students, because I know you're going to have many, and I know they're going to have many and have much success. So just great to have you um, have you doing what you're doing. So awesome stuff there. And to the audience, as always, thank you for tuning in. Hope you got a lot of value out of this. If you did, don't forget to subscribe to the podcast, uh, leave me a review on the Apple iTunes Store, and if you're watching this on our YouTube channel, Mission Matters Money, definitely give us a subscribe there, but also leave us some comments in the video. Love to know what kind of projects and things that you're working on. And Amy, thanks again for coming back on the show. You bet. Thanks, Adam. Talk soon.